Hey, what's going on guys? Tim Money in here, and today we're transforming this into this. So what we have here is a fully functional Desert Atom nuclear power plant. So first things first, we're going to show off the, uh, the reactor itself, obviously. We have an RBMK reactor with a whopping total of five fuel rods in here and four steam channels. Look at that. Beautiful. Nothing too fancy. It's got thorium in there. Pretty nice. We have a, a storage thing here so you can store any extra fuel rods you might have. And we can jump down here. And here is the um, water slash steam exchanger things here. Water comes from the cooling tower. And steam goes up that little spout up there. You can see it goes up there. And I'll be going to show you where that goes in a second. So it goes out from up down there, up here, to the outside of a reactor building here. And then it comes down here. There's going to be a little cover here at some point. Through here. And then it goes to our first steam turbine. So what we have here, first steam turbine, this is ultra-dense steam, which then goes into dense steam, super-dense steam. Which then goes into dense steam, which then goes into regular steam, which then goes into low pressure steam, which then goes into this big storage, this big tank here. So it's like a buffer. So if we ever like accidentally broke um, one of our cooling, one of our tanks down here, we have two of these for water, for um, redundancy. It's better to have two than, than, than to just have one. So there we go. We got that. So the water goes into the cooling tower. And then it goes into both the pipes. Well, basically it goes into this really. Because it, it doesn't go in. Okay. Alright, now I can show off the inside. So, first things first, our bottom floor here, we have our ME server um, drive system here. And over here we have uh, our energy acceptor, our HE to RF converter, all that fun stuff. Over here we have two batteries that are just storing power. These two are kind of like inputting slash outputting. Very confusing. Uh, over here we have a storage room or like a little bedroom, whatever you want. It's all for you to decide. Up here we have our centrifuges, our uranium hexafluoride tanks, a, a technium steel barrel, which connects into our gas centrifuges here. And we have a little storage thing here. We have a steel crate for more storage. Then we have our RBMK console, so you can monitor your nuclear reactor and see if it's working well. Make sure it is. <laughs> Look at that. Very nice. All right. Then we come up here. We have more of those spark energy storage blocks for more redundant power. So if you don't have enough power, then life's going to be kind of terrible for you. And that is pretty much it for the uh, power plant, guys. If you like the video, please like, subscribe, and comment down below. If you guys want, I will make a, a part two where I show you how I build this thing. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time.